European leaders arriving in Brussels for a key summit which they say will help bring about a return to growth, but which economists say can only mean more austerity. Leaders are signing off on a 500 billion euro permanent rescue fund for the Eurozone, while agreeing to strict rules to ensure EU nations manage balanced budgets. German Chancellor Angela Merkel had that in mind when she called for the EU to help Greece to achieve budget targets they've been set. Berlin even suggested that an EU commissioner watches over Athens' budget, a suggestion that's been rejected in Brussels. Danish Prime Minister Ella thorning smith whose country has the six-month rotating EU presidency, said the meeting was not just about the debt crisis. It's very, very important that we have a new discipline uh, in our economies throughout Europe. Uh, the second we need to discuss is uh, growth and jobs in Europe. But while an estimated 20 billion euros is being set aside for job creation, some MEPs think the answer lies in better cooperation. It shall not solve uh, this uh, euro crisis because it's only about fiscal discipline. And if you want to solve the euro crisis, we need also to tackle the problem of solidarity, how we can mutualize debts and how we can lower the interest rates. The European Stability Mechanism is being signed today. It's a 500 billion euro permanent bailout fund that could be operational as early as July. A fiscal compact will ensure nations manage their budgets effectively.